I don't like that the lid gives me rules, do's and don'ts. Uh, don't tell me what to do. Hi everybody, I'm Jessica Nicole Dickerson, aka JD, and welcome back to another video. So you may notice that the background is a little blank, and yes, the decor, I set up this frame, it's literally on an Amazon box right now, trying to make the background look cute. Is it working? I really hope it is. <laughs> so in today's video, it's going to be very chill. I'm going to do a double unboxing for the Unplugged book box. I'm really excited. I haven't opened any of their boxes before or even seen any of their videos. So I don't know what to expect. So this is going to be a really thrilling unboxing. So I hope we're just chilling together. I hope you have a beverage of choice. Mine currently is tea. And I know you might be like, Jess, when do you ever drink tea? Don't worry, I've already had my two coffee coffees for the day. I'm trying to tap out after two. Like I really shouldn't have to make a second pot of French press coffee throughout the day. We'll see how long that sticks. So I made some tea, which still has tons of caffeine in it. But you know what? I'm trying, okay? Don't judge me. And also notice the phrase on the mug. Maybe freeze, pause it, read it. Makes me laugh every time. It just makes me so happy, so get your get your snacks get your tea get your stuff and let's chill and watch me open these boxes it's gonna be so exciting oh my god <laughs> so this book box is all about self-care and then they offer a lot of exclusive products so i'm really excited to dive in i don't know which one to start with so i think i'm gonna start with this green one so you can kind of see there's a green box and a purple box it's like you know which pill do i take from the matrix i don't know Ooh, i think the green box is heavier yeah, I'll open the green box first. <laughs> okay, let's see. Especially because I've just moved. I'm like looking for tons of, you know, stuff to like decorate. As you can tell from my very blank background. And you can kind of see my snow globes up there. But yeah. Ooh, I should have brought scissors. That would have been smart. I never have scissors on hand. You'd think with me having done a couple of unboxings. Like I'm definitely not a pro yet, but I'm getting there. You'd think I'd have scissors ready. Nope. I'm gonna use my handy dandy pen. Oh, that wasn't too hard. Okay. Let's open this sucker up. I can't see. Okay. First thing I see is I think some fall themed. The spoiler card is fall themed. Spoiler info and photo challenge. So here is the spoiler card. It says transformations. September. Oh, so this is the September adult fiction box. Oh, it's their two year anniversary. That's so cute. Okay, so I see, I think the first thing I see is a candle, which is great because I'm not in a dorm room anymore and I can burn my own candles. Comes, I'm an adult. <laughs> if you don't know, I just graduated college, so that's why I said that. In dorm rooms, for some reason, you can't burn candles. I guess they don't trust this to not burn the building now, so you know. I can smell it and it smells like pineapple. Whoa. <gasps> okay, first of all, is this ombre? Is this an ombre candle? <laughs> candle? I can't speak. Is this an ombre candle? What? Okay. Natural, pure, honest, unplugged book box. I have no idea how you would pronounce this, but this is the candle design. Very Halloween. Whoa. Okay, let me see if I can try and... Okay, I'll look at the spoiler card at the end because I don't want to spoil myself, but let's smell this guy. I think... Is this plastic or glass? Oh, I think it's a wood one too. I need to buy a lighter. Oh, okay, that's cinnamon. It wasn't pineapple, I was smelling with cinnamon. Oh my gosh. So burn at least one hour in first use. Trim wick. Oh. There's rules. I don't like that the lid gives me rules. Do's and don'ts. Uh, don't tell me what to do. <laughs> but this smells lovely and it looks great. I don't know where I'm going to put it, but I'm so excited. I'm going to burn it while I read books on my bed. Oh. The vibe my bedroom is giving me, even though it's blank right now, future vibes, is going to be great. Okay, there's a ton of that brown stuff, you know, in book boxes, so I'm moving it aside. Let's pull out another product at random. Just a little round tube. Oh, what's this? Okay. This is Persephone. Um, so this is a lotion unplugged book box. Oh, let's smell this. Oh, sorry. I can show you the lid a little bit better. There you go. You can pause it and look at it closer if you'd like. 
Ooh, lotions. Whoa. Whoa. Definitely giving me pomegranate vibes, yep. And it's like, let's test it out now, puppy, because my hands are dry and you don't have to look at these crusty hands anymore. Lotion, 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 lotion. Ooh, it's very smooth. Oh, oh. I love this. Oh. oh. And the smell isn't too overwhelming. It smells like a nice, like, body lotion. You know, not, not the ones you get from Victoria's Secret, but, like, something nice. And it's super moisturizing. Oh, my hands look so shiny now. Let's get those elbows, too. Ooh. Ooh. That's nice. Okay. Now let's go in and grab another product. This one feels weird. Oh, it's a tea strainer. Oh, it's a tea strainer. Oh, that's so fun. So you can like put tea at the bottom here. That's nifty. I've never used one of these before. I'm, I'm, I don't drink too much tea. Um, but I do, once I'm done using up like the 100 Lipton tea things that my parents gave me, like the big box, I'll put a picture up so you know what I'm talking about. They gave me like a bunch of those when I first started college and I'm still working my way through them. Um, so as soon as I'm done with that, I'm gonna start using like single leaf, like, you know, where you buy the can that comes with like tea leaves, reducing my paper waste, hopefully. So this is fun. Okay, next item. It's like Christmas. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff. Okay, let's do this. Okay, first off, I love the color. I have no idea what this is. The blanket? I like that it's yellow and it has flowers. It's like, what is this? Is this? A, oh, it's a scarf. Okay, wait. Okay, I see donuts. It says Luke's. Luke's, Luke's coffee. What, what is that? What's that a reference to? Oh, I don't know. Stars Hollow. You like coffee only with my, is that Duncan? Or dragon? No, that's a Y. D R Y G E N. Or is that an O? Oxygen. I can't read. <laughs> I was trying to read this quote. It's like, you like coffee only with my oxygen. Wow. It took me way too long to figure that out. Oh, this pizza? Okay, let me try and show you it a little bit better. That is so cool. I have been wanting to purchase like a scarf for my hair to kind of like be one of those cool girls that like has a scarf. This is like too long. Like, isn't that what's supposed to be like hanging? I don't know. I do like it. I love the color. I think it's very interesting. <laughs> the graphics are very interesting. Like I like that there's donuts and stuff. I wonder what book this is referring to. I have no idea. But, but that is nice. And this feels like satiny. Ooh, my hair's gonna love this. Okay, put that down there. Let's go ahead and grab the next item. Another little thing. There's so many items. Oh, there's a Oh, there's a face mask. It's like eye mask and it has like the gel that you can like refrigerate to make it cold, right? Is that what you're supposed to do? Or is it just for comfort that it's gel? I need instructions for everything, obviously. I don't know how to use anything, but will I read those instructions? Probably not, <laughs> but that's really fun. I also like the vibe it's giving off. Ooh. Okay, let's see, let's see. I'm taking way too long with this, I'm sorry. Okay. I think it says Alyssa Cole, which kind of is the author. So I, I think I know what book this is, which is like kind of exciting. Oh my gosh. Okay, we got some more announcements for Cozy Autumn's new available box. I think that's, oh, I missed one little item before I opened the book. There is this cute little The Dashwood Sisters, a simple bookish co- oh, I guess that's the company that made this. I have no idea what this is. Is this tea? I'm gonna have to check the spoiler card, but it's this little tiny thing. Very cute. I'll check the spoiler card to see what it is, because it might be tea leaves, which would be really interesting with the strainer. Okay, it is time to open the little book. Clean, I'm trying to clean up a little bit. Before. Okay, okay. It's paperback, it's paperback, Let's see. No way, no way. Oh my God, 
I can't. My hands, I shouldn't have lotion on because now I can't open anything. Okay, I see so many people talking about this. And now I have my own copy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't expecting this. Oh my god, that's so exciting and it's signed. Oh when no one is watching so when no one is watching by Alyssa cole is a thriller and let's see let's check out the first sentence and see how we feel about it mm, i haven't read any of her books yet but i definitely want to dive into her works uh, i've heard nothing 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 but good things she's written so many so many books and i i need to get i need to get into it okay so the prologue is history is fucking wild <laughs> that's the first sentence Oh my god, I love that. History is fucking- Okay, I already know that I'm gonna love this book. I might save it for October. The fact that I got this book and have been thinking about purchasing it. I need my tea. I need to calm down. I need to- Oh, I'm so excited. Mm. Bro, this first box had one, two, three, four, five, six different things. That's insane. Okay, let's just check out the spoiler card and see what I missed. So yeah, there's the Dreamcatcher eye mask. Oh, it's Stephen King themed. That's really cool. Let's see. Gilmore Girls scarf. Oh, no wonder I didn't understand what the reference. Never seen Gilmore Girls. Girls. Gilmore Girls. So hard on the mouth. <laughs> okay. And then we have the name of the wind candle. Oh, I need to read that book. It is on the short list of to be bought books. I have too many books already. Eventually. Okay, yeah. Per Persephone lotion. Um, let's see. Jane Austen tea diffuser. Oh, that's fun. Okay. And if you want, here is the spoiler card. You can pause it and try and read it or zoom in. Take a screenshot of all the items and where all of them are located from. But, wow. This was only one box. And I don't even think I deserve the right to have a second box. <laughs> that is just so cool. Blown away. Blown away. Um, I think my favorite thing in this book box is the book itself because I really wanted it. And now that I have it, I, I feel unworthy. Okay, now we have the purple box. So I'm thinking this is going to be the August box. And again, this unplugged book box. I'm pleasantly surprised, man. <laughs> okay, so let's crank her open. Let's see. Okay, ooh, almost dropped it. So we have here the card and reinvention. Hmm, so this is the young adult. Oh, September. Oh, so I got both the adult and the young adult for September. Oh my god, thank you, Unplugged. I did not expect that. Oh my god. Okay. So there's obviously the spoilers are on the back, so I'm gonna put that away and let's see. Obviously there's all this stuff, so let's I think. What? Oh that's so cool. I have a bathtub now. I could use bath bombs. Oh it's Sailor Moon thing. I love Sailor Moon. Like no joke love. I used to watch it all the time. It was the first anime that I like binged when I was younger. And I blame Sailor Moon for my manga and anime addiction. So this is great. Oh, and I can kind of smell it. Okay, I'm gonna put this somewhere so it doesn't break or explode. Okay. No. This out. Oh. This is really cute packaging. It says, let me pull out this little baggie. Came in a little baggie, how cute. Okay, let's see. Poet, apple lip scrub? A lip scrub? Oh, and the ingredient list is so good. So it's sugar, honey, grapeseed oil, coconut oil, and pigment of natural flavoring. That is so cool. Oh, it's a poet X. I totally missed the X. How did I miss that? Okay, so I just thought it was poet, but I just realized there's an X. So it's poet X themed. Oh my god, I smell it. Mm. It's an interesting smell. Don't know if I love it too much, but it's a sugar lip scrub. That's really handy, especially as we get into fall and it starts to get a little 
colder. We need that, you know, that lip scrub. Exfoliation. I also love the little bag it came in. Okay. Let's see. I think that's the book. Okay. We have another kind of jar thing. It's metal. Let's see. So we have... Is that Fire Haven? The Dark Dark Wood Magic Falling Apples. I think it's a candle. So this is what it looks like. I have no idea what it's based off of, but let's see. It's definitely a candle. Oh my god, it has crystals in it. That's really nifty. Okay. Ooh, that's really cinnamony, but like a light cinnamon flavor. Flavor. Scent. Wow. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's... Next item. It's also in a little baggie. I'm going to collect all these baggies to use them for something. I don't know, but I will. Oh, Bella and Edward shampoo. That's really funny. It's pomegranate because, you know, there's a pomegranate on the new Twilight book. That's really funny. Never a Twilight. Don't plan on it. Um, and I probably won't use the shampoo because if you can't tell, my hair is kind of big and frizzy and I have a routine with my hair. So I might not use this. I might hold on to it and... Um, put it in a little giveaway pile because I've been getting so many boxes from companies I, I collect all the items that I don't use and I'm gonna try and give them away eventually maybe like a little Christmas giveaway thing I I don't know I it's an exciting idea for me but I, I hope I follow through but yeah let's keep the digging in okay I think the next item is another kind of big item so let's see this guy is this another scarf does Unplug always do that card? Is that the same? I love the color. Let's see. Oh, it's a different texture. It's not like the satin one for the other Gilmore Girls one. This feels more cottony. Ooh, and it's huge. Whoa, what is this? I see Crooked Kingdom. Okay, wait. There's a lot of words. Let me let me digest for a second. Okay. Fairy tales are more than true, not because they tell us that dream or dragons exist, but because they tell us dragons can be beaten. And that's by Neil Gaiman. Wow. So it's this huge thing. I don't even know how to show you. So those are all the words I read. That was the quote. And then there's like books all around it. So this is Mockingjay. Let's see what other things there are. There's tons of things. The Battle of the Labyrinth. I saw Crooked Kingdom somewhere. There's a giant dragon on it, which is so cool. So I guess this is like a thing I can hang on my wall. I don't know if I'm going to hang it on my wall just because I have an aesthetic to keep you see my, my minimalist aesthetic. <laughs> but that's really cool. Oh, there's Divergent. Um, I might try and hang it next to my bookshelves, possibly. Maybe even on my door. That's exciting. That's that's pretty cool. So I think this is like a tapestry kind of thing. So you've already pulled it down to be small again. Okay. okay. Moving on to the next thing. So I think we have the book with the note. Is there any other little items hiding? I'm assuming this is from the authors, and luckily I can't read the signature, so let's see what book this is. YA. I saw- oh, I ripped it already. I love this paper that they put it in. I think I have to rip it. It is grown by Tiffany D. Jackson. <laughs> okay, so if you don't know, I was on the PR list to get grown and do the whole earrings thing, and I was so excited to do that um, and like post it with the book on Instagram and Twitter, whatever. And um, because I was in Hawaii and America's going through it right now because of our administration, um, lots of mail has been getting lost. So my um, arc of this got lost in the mail and I informed the team. So then they reached out to me and said, okay, we'll send you a finished copy, don't worry. And now I have this. 
<laughs> so if I end up getting a finished copy of this, I'll make sure to give it away. But I'm really excited to read this. Oh no, I just made my TBR and I really want I really want to change it. That's so bad. Um, and it's shorter than I thought, so I hopefully will get through this soon. Maybe I'll put it on my October TBR with Alyssa Cole. Can we also mention that both authors are black? That's great. I'm... Oh my god, and she wrote us a note! Okay, I'm going to let you in on a little secret. This book terrifies me. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so that's her little note to us. That's so cool. It's white and it's all. Okay, so my favorite things about this book box are the books, 100%. These are two books that I'm really anticipating and looking forward to. Now I kind of want to read them now, but I have too many things going on in September. And I have my list of books that I'm going to read for the Brass Readathon. So if you haven't seen that TBR, go check it out. But I'm in love. I have no words. I have no words. I'm just, you know, sitting here enjoying my life with my books. <laughs> this was the best decision ever. I'm so happy that I reached out or that Unplugged reached out to me and that I responded to them. Because of course I'm not taking, some people are emailing me for things and I'm like, hey, I gotta let you down because like, I don't want my whole content to be all about other people's content if you get my drift. So I'm really happy that I decided to work with Unplugged. I hope you guys really enjoy book unboxings. Um, they're really fun to film and I hope you guys like them. But yeah, that's it for today's video. Make sure you subscribe if you liked it. I also linked down my Patreon. Um, if you're interested in supporting me further and want extra content, obviously you do not have to sign up, so don't worry. Um, but yeah, I'm this is this has been such a journey and I'm so happy and this is probably a very long video so if you stay to the very end make sure to comment down below um some fun emojis like I'll put some examples of funny emojis like the poop emoji is a great emoji um the vomiting emoji always makes me laugh like put on like put the creepy <laughs> emojis down like spiders skulls I feel like it would really freak out other people to like see in the comments that freaky stuff in the bottom <laughs> but yeah thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next video Bye.